Hey y'all, hey, y'all know me, dropping in to spread a little tea, and you know how we do it, so let's get right into it. So you all know I don't do Miss Brianna on weekends, I won't, to have my weekends for my family and have a peace of mind. But guess what, Miss Brianna, I'm back, and I'm a little disturbed to have to come back to something so sickening. I'm lost for words. I'm truly lost for words. I'm sure you guys have seen on other posts. I know my girl, Sweet Ma for Life, had it on hers. And we've already discussed this. And um, <laughs> look, when her and I get together, we just basically talking over each other and saying the same thing because we think so much alike. And the things this girl do, we just... Is unbelievable. But anyway, Miss Brianna posted. Well, we got it from um well, I got it from um like I said, sweet mom for life page, but it's a post like a text message that she sent to her son. And in that text message, her son supposedly sent a message back to her. But after Everyone researching the text. I'm going to let you guys take a look at this. Just take a look at this. This is the message that Brianna sent to her son. Good morning, handsome. Mom just wants you to know that I love you so much. And if there is anything you ever wanted to talk to mommy about, you can. If you feel like mommy is missing something, please tell me so I can be more present. I love you and I'm trying to be the best mommy I can ever be. Now, this is supposed to be the response her son sent. I love you too. Good morning. And no, there is truly nothing missing because you are the best and God has all of us. And you have a special place in my heart. I love you so much. Everything I am today is because of your encouragement, mom. Thank you for always being by my side, mom. Thank you for having more faith in my dreams than I do, mom. No one in the world could replace you in my life, mom. Heart, 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 heart. Now, this is my message to you, Sybil. You are, this is sickening. And the reason it's sickening is because you sent that text message, allegedly. The, the text, the response from your son, allegedly. If you put that response in Google, this is what you get. So, get ready guys, because you're not going to believe this. But if you... Put in this link and you click on it as you see it says special message for mother you get 80 different messages <laughs> this is crazy thank you for being by my side mom thank you for having more faith in my dreams than i do mom no one in this world can replace you in my life mom and it goes on and on that's where she got the response from that she acted like her son sent her back allegedly she went on Google. She found something that she thought would suit us to get us to shut up, to make her look like she's a, a, a really good mom. And if you're a really good mom, <laughs> nothing needs to be said. She went to the extreme. Y'all, listen. Now, this is serious. We need to start praying for this lady. We need to start praying for Mr. LaTruth, them kids. Let me tell you something. This is not normal behavior. This is some psychotic shh. This is not right. This is scary. This is the type of shit that when something, these type of people, when things don't go the way that they want them to go, they have no limit. Like, this young lady needs help. And to all of her followers or fans, Team Breeze, there is no way possible that y'all can agree with everything she is doing. And if you guys care that much about her, someone needs to reach out. Someone needs to be a listening ear. Someone needs to let her know this is not okay. To go through all of this, 
<clears throat> and to literally post, nothing else even matters. I love being a mom and I do my best to be the best mom I can ever be. And for this to be a lie, your son didn't even text you this. You did. Is unbelievable that you took the time to do this. Something is not right. And then you wonder why we own you. This came from your other page of Brianna Hampton, not Miss Brianna. This came from your other page. We are posting what you posted. And then we investigated why, because you are a liar, a big liar. Yo, co I'm sorry. Your followers may fall for your BS, but we ain't standing for it. Anywho, moving on. So, <clears throat> I was told that you and Janelle stopped following each other yesterday. He removed everything from his Facebook page and Instagram page that he had put up um, regarding you and him. And then within 24 hours, you guys are back following one another. And the first picture he posts is this. Why? You have a problem. A big issue with her dad posting her when he has her, making a video with her, posting a picture of her. You lose your damn mind. But you let your best friend, allegedly, post a picture of your daughter throwing up. I don't know what this is. This is what you allowed him to do. But you know what? He can only do what you allow him. But as a man, he should know better than this. What I do know is one thing for certain, two things for sure. Y'all are meant for each other. Y'all both are immature. You both play internet games. You're both playing with fire. And you are both using one another. He's using you for the clout. You using him because you think he can take you somewhere. He can get you somewhere. But all this time you've been... Uh, flying out and laying up allegedly moved the man in allegedly you have not made a move name one thing that he has done for you hell he didn't even get you a valentine's day gift allegedly because if he did we would have seen it you never posted pictures of you walking the, the runway like you just you just a, you just a big ball of a lie. And I'm glad he using you. And he going to use you until you dried up both places. Pockets in the pants. And when he's done with you, you're not going to have anything. I don't wish that on you, but if you can't see you being used, then you get whatever's coming your way. But I believe this is karma. He is karma. His name is karma. He coming to get your ass. And you too young, dumb, and immature to see it. You really think this 27-year-old man is coming to wife up a 30-year-old woman with four kids and a whole ball of drama? Use your head. He ain't coming to wife you up. He coming to run you up. Just like you did the truth. You had a plan. <laughs> he got a plan too. Word of advice. Stop worried about your soon to be ex-husband. He good. He making moves. Big moves. Worry about that. The man, that boy that you land with every night. That's what you should be concerned about. You need to be asking yourself, why me? Why you choose me? Out of all the women he could possibly get, why did he choose me? <laughs> it was in his plan. I'm about to play another video. That I got from keeping up with the truths. And I'm not going to play the whole video. 
because it hurts my heart. And I, I, I just couldn't stand to hear the baby voice. And it just, I, I'm not going to play the whole video, but I just want you guys to see. Miss, I would never call CPS. She called, she tried to call CPS on me saying that Amora don't eat. She malnourished. All Amora do is eat noodles. And she doesn't know where I live at, but she's really concerned about them. What's okay? I don't mind my comment, but anyways. Beef, It'll be delicious. No, it looks like get two beef noodles. So that was Brianna's son in, in their pantry fixing noodles for his dinner. And the rest of the video just show him, you know, preparing the noodles, putting them in the microwave, whatever. Um, he was really excited about fixing them noodles. And uh, I, I, I say I play this to say this. You got bigger shit you should be worried about. Grow up, little lady. If you're confused about life, the direction you're going, ask for help. It's help out there. Because all this lying you're doing about self-healing, you did self-healing, you did this, you did. It's all a lie. It's all for show. It's all for the internet. Because actions is what count and you're showing that n n if you did, look, I'm not even getting ready to say if you did do the work, it didn't work because you didn't do it because if you did, it would have worked. You need some help. In my opinion, I think you need to do a public apology to your ex-husband, soon to be ex-husband. You need to apologize to him, to his family. And you need to let him know, I need your help. As far as with the more, I need your help. And your other key is father, you need to let them know, I need your help, meaning his household looked very stable. Maybe you should consider sending your kids to him and sending them more with her father and checking yourself in somewhere. Just saying, forget everything. Because you're about to hit rock bottom anyway. Your numbers are falling. You're spending up all your cash on trips and Mr. Wu-Tang. You always in designer. Mr. Wu-Tang always in designer. And your kids is always in like children's place and Walmart. Nothing is wrong with those places. Because my son wear it. But you better believe I ain't finna be out here in designer and he in children's place. You better believe I'm not spending more dropping 30,000 on the man I just met. And my kids ain't had a haircut. Or daughter hair is not combed. You better believe that. I'm not doing that one. That's what I'm saying. Your priorities is messed up. Reach out for help, Brianna. It's out there. If you're listening to this, this ain't no. Look, you can take it how you want to take it. Because I can care less about how you feel about me. But sister, if you need to reach out. Reach out. And don't reach out to none of your fan base, your followers, because they are your enablers. They see this stupid sh you're doing and they're making you think it's okay. Now I had a lot more that I was going to put out there about you, but at this point, I'm done. For tonight, I'm done. Because I can actually say right now. This is when you need your mom. This is when somebody needs to just grab you, wrap their arms around you, let you know it's going to be okay, but you can't do it this way. That's it for now, guys. As always, thanks for watching. I will talk to you guys shortly. Bye. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and hit the notification bell so you can be alerted every time I upload a video.